know, South Asia is um, one of the largest uh, producers of livestock and livestock products uh, in the world. Uh, the predominant livestock uh, in South Asia uh, are really ruminants, uh, cattle, buffalo, sheep uh, and goats. Uh, and uh, these represent a very important part of the econ economy in South Asia, especially agriculture economy. FMD um, is a transboundary animal disease. Uh, the FMD disease uh, as a disease moves uh, through movement of animals, uh, through trade, uh, and therefore almost all the South, East, South Asian countries are now affected by FMD. FMD is also caused by several different virus strains. So although we call FMD as just one disease, there are three separate diseases, there are three different virus strains that exist here. And you require different vaccines uh, for different strains of the viruses. Uh, thirdly, uh, uh, as you know, the disease is mainly, uh, can mainly be controlled by vaccination program. Uh, the whole of South Asia is endemic, the virus is circulating all the time. Uh, the disease is, if you like, entrenched in this part of the world. Uh, the vaccination program that has now been introduced in India as a national program uh, is quite a challenging program, it's quite an ambitious program. Uh, but the problem, one of the biggest problems is that uh, availability of good uh, good quality efficacious vaccines, A. B, uh, the ability to deliver this vaccine uh, in a, a proper manner so that animals get this vaccine uh, in a proper manner so that immunity is induced. At the moment the infrastructure uh, is not that adequate to be able to deliver this vaccine. Secondly, there are countries within the region uh, which are not able to afford vaccination program and if only one country engages in a vaccination program that doesn't really serve the region to control the, the, the disease. It has to be controlled on a regional basis and it has to require collaboration of all the countries within South Asia to work together uh, collaboratively and concerted, in a concerted manner to support vaccination program and control program. The, the, the other issue with the with control program is it's not only just a technology issue. Vaccination is one component, but there are several other issues related to the policy, the movement control, the socioeconomic conditions of the farmers who maintain these animals, the biosecurity environment within the farming production sector as well. So these are quite a number of challenges uh, that are confronting this particular region to control FMD. FAO uh, has a program in collaboration with OIE called GFTARDS. Uh, which stands for Global Framework for Control of Transboundary Animal Diseases. Under this uh, program, uh, FAO uh, engages uh, with the governments uh, in this region um, uh, through a, a collaborative program, um, a bilateral collaborative program, as well as through the regional approach engaging with the regional organization called SARC, uh, 